what is the place of women in Sufi practice? Um, do women act as dervishes? Um, how do they practice? Is there a different women's practice? As far as uh, the spirituality of Islam or the inner dimension of Islam, uh, which we call as tasawwuf is concerned, we are talking about the spirit. We are talking about the spiritual journey. And with spirit comes no gender. Right? Sharia is something which is my outward conduct to live a life on this planet Earth in a certain way, with certain moralities, with certain ethics, with certain code of behavior, right? Mm -hmm. And since physically man and woman are different, right, so there you will find the difference in the Sharia, right? Mm -hmm. For example, uh, women, I mean, it's not about the women rights or the equality of gender because there is no gender with the, with the spirit, mm -hmm. right? And equality of gender is because there is, when we talk about equality of gender, we are saying that there is difference in gender, mm -hmm. right? So when there is difference in gender, there would be some differences in conduct and in behavior. For example, no matter how uh, how I advocate, right, the, the gender equality, but still I cannot give birth to a baby, right? right? Mm -hmm. We cannot be equal with the women in, the, mm -hmm. in that sense. Certainly, the women is higher and superior than me, right, mm -hmm. in that sense. Now, if I say that, no, I want to be equal with, uh, with women, I cannot. So, in the physical sense, I mean, the gender, we have the different paths, our way of living, right, even our physical existence, right, they are different and we have to accept that. But when we talk about spirituality, there is no gender in it. There is no female spirit. There is no male spirit as such. What you call as a feminine spirit is a different thing, right? It is not gendered based as such. So, uh, in spirituality in its essence, uh, there is no gender, there is no concept of gender as such, and the Sufi practices uh, of a male and a female are the same. They go through the same uh, things. Somehow the practices would be different because we are outwardly different. For example, uh, women, they, they go through their periods like the month. So certainly there will be a difference. But that is a minor difference because they, the phys physiology is different, right? So they'll be going through pain, they, they'll be going through some sort of, if, if you want to understand, not cleanliness physically, mm -hmm. right? And due to that weakness, they might be having some psychological fluctuations or the behavioral fluctuations according to that time, right? Mm -hmm. So, outwardly, there might be some differences in the practice, but in principle, there is no uh, difference. Uh, women are welcome and there are, uh, I mean, throughout the history of the Sufism, uh, there have been uh, different women who attained the different stations. So, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, I mean, does not judge you on, on your gender. It is not sin to be born as a man and it is not sin to be born as a woman, <laughs> right? We are one in that sense and our spirit is one and our beloved is one and that path is also, I mean, it can be unique but that path of love is one, one path. So there is no different as such.